today I am also announcing that as part of our tax cuts, we will make interest on car loans fully deductible. So a man who's, a lot of you people are in the car industry, actually, I met a lot of them backstage. What do you do? I'm in the car industry. But a lot of them, and I told him about it, he's a very knowledgeable person. He said, here's a guy, he's done it all his life, he's sitting right over there, I don't want to embarrass him. But he said, where did you come up with that idea? That's the coolest thing. It's like the paperclip again, right? It's like the paperclip Somebody comes up with a paper clip and everybody says, why the hell didn't I think of that, right? <laughs> Somebody came up with a paper clip, I guess made a lot of money. And other people said, gee. But he said, you know, I've been in the car industry all my life. I've never thought about that. So we're going to make it fully deductible, the interest payments. That's going to revolutionize your industry. This will stimulate massive domestic auto production and make car ownership dramatically more affordable for millions and millions of working American families. This is a phenomenal thing, if I do say so myself. <laughs> Who likes that idea? Isn't that great? Because oftentimes I lose the teleprompter. You know, teleprompters go out, but she lost the teleprompter last week. Did you see it? She was talking about 32 days to the election, and she goes... There are 32 days. Oh. Oh, my God. I just lost a teller. 32. Then she, 32. 32. 32. 32. And I said, what the hell happened to her? And then the teleprompter kicked back on. 32 days to the election. You don't, you don't want this for your president. So we will build this policy, and it's called Build It in America Plan. It's Build It in America because when foreign leaders and CEOs call me up to complain about our tariffs, my answer will be very simple. Build it in America. You don't have any tariffs. Build it right here in Detroit. You don't have any tariffs. Build it in Dearborn or Lansing or Grand Rapids or Flint. When we do all of this, you will witness nothing less than the launch of a new American industrial revolution. Thousands of factories will open up all across our land. Great paying blue collar jobs will lift up those who have suffered so terribly over the past four years. You heard the numbers in the auto industry. It's collapsing. Inflation will come down fast. American cars and products will be exported and admired all throughout the world again. Young people will move from the coasts to big cities into the heartlands to build their fortunes on the new frontier of the American Midwest. They're going to move back. Instead of leaving, they're going to be moving back. And I'm telling you right now, standing here in the center of this once great city, that by the end of my term, the entire world will be talking about the Michigan miracle and the stunning rebirth of Detroit. That's going to happen very quickly. With your vote, we will bring back our country, we will rebuild our country, and we will reunite our country with American heart, American grit, and American hands.